everyone so today is Tuesday um, it's been one week since the day I left my pharmacy job it's starting to get hot in here um, what I want to do tonight is go to the old apartment and film um, my uh, king trip for Philippines so it's gonna be next week and um, I do want to um, document the the packing and things that I need to take with me and um, this trip will be very special because it's gonna be a six months tour to Philippines uh, the reason why it's really long because I never experienced going home to Philippines from United States for such a very long time and I am going to take advantage of my leave of absence at the same time because um, I want to spend time with my family back home um, this is gonna be very special because uh, just want to say my my dad had a severe heart attack last year so I went on emergency leave around summertime and it was really uh, disheartening and I didn't want to end up like going home and not seeing him again and so as my family so I really want to um, spend time with them this time so everything hopefully will turn out well the way I wanted to however um, this morning I did receive a Viber message from my brother that my dad is in the ER uh, that was around 6 30 in the morning here so that's like 6 30 in the evening in the Philippines so so I just called him and he said that um, my dad got up admitted to the hospital right now and they're trying to check and see if everything is okay um, I'm kind of nervous because my dad doesn't really want to um, talk he doesn't really like to talk much about anything he's just really quiet so um, I'm glad that he he told us he told my brother that he's not feeling well today so otherwise we'll just trying to guess games guessing game and I don't know what else to do um, that's just the way his personality is so um, the trip for the Philippines so I really just want to talk to you about it really quick um, so the first thing I want to do is to spend time with my family I want to do travel on the places that I've never been to especially like the islands um, down in the south area with the beaches um, however I also wanted to um, do a lot of um, soul searching reflection uh, this is more of like a sabbatical leave for me um, finding myself finding my purpose in life um, I'm actually wearing a t-shirt <laughs> bless this city New York this is a church in New York City. I went to the church last weekend and I actually love the pastor's sermon. Um, it's about finding your life's purpose, um, why the reason why you are here. So you need to find that while you're still living. And to be honest with you, I still don't know why my, what my purpose in life is and I'm still finding it. Um, I'm trying to um, do some reflection like why am I doing all these videos and I really enjoy them um, I actually enjoy them more than working in the pharmacy to be honest with you however um, pharmacy has been my career all this time and I do love being a pharmacist 
I do enjoy working with my colleagues. However, like um, working, I think I have to I have to separate like job work that pays your your bills and like hobby and the things that you love the most and what makes you happy like like deep inside really happy so i um l last year i was able to uh, find time and cultivate my passion and that happens to be photography and videography but it's still like my my husband even asked me like why are you doing all this um videos and like photography why like you can't really put down your phone or your camera every time we go somewhere like i really love it and that's just like you know i'm so happy whenever i do it all the time so when i go to philippines i need to find my purpose and if i don't well i'm gonna still find it maybe i find it here in the states so um yeah that's pretty much what what i want to do with uh my six months and i am going to document all my um well most most of my um journey in um traveling to back home to philippines so uh another thing too is Yeah, I need to find my purpose. <laughs> I feel like, you know, I'm already 36 and I'm just like trying to find myself, really. Um. So another thing that the pastor said at the, at the church last Sunday was um, make sure that you spend all your time wisely because that's the only important um, important thing that you have right now that you can take back so all the material things like even this car I'm going to sell this eventually because we're moving to New York City and the traffic there and parking is really crazy and that's gonna stress me out more so uh, at first it was gonna be it's it's really a hard decision to let go but then I realized you know if like if I needed a car in the city like it's just gonna stress me out there's always uber or taxi cab or I can take the subway wherever I want to so it's really convenient um, but here in North Carolina like you really need to have a car all the time that's why I have it but like material things you know you can always replace it but time is irreplaceable okay like I said um, trying to find purpose that's the main goal in to um, find the things that makes me happy makes me really happy deep inside and um, just try to enjoy life to the fullest um, life is too short I know they it's always cheesy to say that but it's true um, I don't want to like find out that like tomorrow's my last day but I haven't found my purpose and I you know like I haven't like done so many things that I would regret it you know like there's a lot of people that grow old and they haven't found their purpose in life and next thing you know they'll be in um, deathbed I, I don't want to be that person so all right well thank you for um, listening to me and hopefully um, some of you will find this video um meaningful and i hope like someone out there can relate to my experiences again it's katherine from roaming tourist productions thank you for watching bye